Welcome to this episode of Meet Your Hoover Neighbor. Today we're at the Hoover Library learning about the entire summer series that's going on that is free for you and your family. So let's get right to it. Jane, I know that today is an exciting day because yes. you guys have been having the, the best little animal show going on. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, so we've had Animal Tales down from Nashville. Um, they did a seven show run over three days for us, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So today is the final two animal shows. So very exciting. <laughs> That's one of many of the free mm -hmm. programs that the Hoover Public Library offers to everyone. Yes. Tell me what else is going on this summer. So this summer we have eight weeks of theater shows. So we just finished the one week and so we have seven more coming up which will include Mad Cat Puppets. Also going to have Arthur Atzma out of Atlanta. He's an amazing sleight of hand magician. Oh, um, okay. After him we're going to have Lucky Diaz which is a band that does both English and Spanish language music. They are Latin Grammy Award winners from California. Wow. This will be the second time they've been on our stage. So there's just always something going on at the library. There's really something always going on. We have story times Monday mornings, Sometimes we have story times on Friday mornings that we rotate so, through. I've brought my ch my grandchildren to story times, and it seems yes. like there's different age groups, maybe. Yes. Yeah, so in the summer, we don't do as many story times, okay. so we focus it in. So the Monday mornings, I do story constellation, and that's for zero to three, and it's a very little much bitty ones, little tiny ones, rocking okay. out and okay. loving story time. Okay. We also have a couple movers and shakers on Friday mornings, which is for all ages, where kids can do interpretive storytelling themselves so it's a little oh. a little more involved and there's lots yeah. of dancing um, and then we have bring your own baby now what is bring your own baby so, bring your own baby means you bring your baby to the uh -huh. library for story times so this is a lot of information yes where do people go to remember which is when and where yes and we have almost a hundred programs in two months wow. so the easiest thing to do is go to our website hooverlibrary.org and you can look at all of the information. You can see what's in the daytime, what's at night, what's on the weekends. We have lots of weekend things as well. Um, we also have things for teens and adults. It's not just for kids at Hoover okay. Public Library. So wow. that's the number one place to go. Wow. So much, so many exciting things. <laughs> and your summer would just be packed out if you just came in and hung out at the library. Yes, yeah, so we have lots of people that don't come to a single event. They're just here for everything else the library has yes. to offer. And but who knew there was so much going on at the Hoover Library? Well, I knew, but you I hope knew. everyone else will know now, yes, too. Yes, <laughs> absolutely. Wasn't that so exciting to hear about all the events going on at the Hoover Public Library this summer? I cannot wait to bring my grandkids. <laughs>